You're a vegetable gardener and it's mid-March and now is a good time to be thinking about starting some seeds indoors or if you happen to be fortunate enough to live in the part of the country where you can actually access thought out soil, you might even do some direct sowing right into the garden. Let me talk first of all about the vegetables that you'll plant indoors in a nice sunny window or greenhouse if you happen to have one to plant out in the garden a little bit later on. So you're starting these now in mid to late March. Leaf lettuce, simply salad blend, which you could keep in containers, sow them directly into containers and then enjoy them sort of a cut and come again sort of deal uh, later in the season through April and May, more through the latter part of April of course, but in 45 days you'll be picking your own salad from that. Spinach plants that you could start now and plant out even during the frost of late April and early May. Cabbage, all the members of the cabbage family, not just the bok choy, all the onions, including the onion sets and multipliers that you buy at the garden center this time of year, and of course the uh, white globe uh, Spanish onions as well. And then directly in the garden, for those, as soon as you can do this, you can plant your carrots directly into the garden, and peas tolerate a great deal of frost as well. So when the soil is workable, you can plant those in the garden, and don't worry about the frost or that you might get some snow, they're going to be okay. You can do the same, by the way, with parsley parsnips. Now, plants that will grow in your garden when direct sown just a little bit later, while there's some frost still arriving in, in mid to late April in most parts of the country, radish, beets, cucumbers for hot, that's a hot crop, so that won't go on the ground until probably late May, early June. Um, basil is another hot crop. You could start indoors in April and plant out in late May, early June. Beans are another, <clears throat> another hot crop for late May, early June. Nasturtiums as well, which are edible. And back to April for just a moment. Start your tomatoes indoors in mid-April. But don't start them any earlier than mid-April or they'll get really stringy on you. And you want nice, short, compact plants that you can plant in the ground after there's six weeks indoors under intense light, whether it's natural or artificial, and then plant them in the ground in June in most parts of the country. Great time of year to peruse the seed racks. And by the way, look for my own Mark's Choice seed varieties at Home Hardware.